your first alert weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. After a little bit of a cool weekend, a warmer day out there for us today, albeit a few more clouds out there as well. But as we roll through the week, temps are going to be spring like all week long. We even have 80s in the forecast, although there is a slight chance of some showers coming in here during the afternoon and evening tomorrow. Today, partly sunny and warmer out there for your highs. Upper 60s down by the beaches with a little cool ocean breeze developing. 67 will be the high in Merle's Inlet. Same for North Myrtle Beach up to 68 in Myrtle Beach. 72 the forecast in Conway and Lumberton looking for 73 in Florence, Darlington, Marion and Lake City. Inland area is certainly looking pretty good as well. Overall, high pressure off to our east will block a disturbance that's off to our west, mainly off to the north. But the tailing cold front may still have enough moisture to squeeze out a shower or two for your Tuesday afternoon and Tuesday evening. We're still going to be talking on seasonably warm weather to stay with us despite a cold front swinging by to our north. Nothing in the way of cold air coming in behind it. That high actually builds back in and continues to supply us with plenty of warmth for the middle and the tail end of the week. Now, as far as any clouds go, again, just a little bit of extra cloud cover for today. Partly sunny skies. You may briefly become mostly cloudy inland, but all in all, not a bad looking day out there. More clouds move in tonight. An isolated shower possible mainly for your Tuesday afternoon and Tuesday evening as that front swings off to the east. Better chances of rain will stay well to our north, though. And we'll continue to talk about dry weather for the rest of that seven day forecast and unseasonably warm weather out there as well. Average highs for this time of the year are in the low to mid 60s. We're going to be talking on seasonably warm weather for the next seven days. Low to mid 70s out there for the Grand Strand from Tuesday straight through Sunday. But watch out down by the beaches. Despite seeing that warmer air, a little breeze will be developing off the ocean to cool things down a little bit immediately by the immediate coastline and the beaches with those ocean temperatures only in the upper 50s to climbing to maybe 60 degrees by week's end. Inland areas, you're going to hit the mid 70s tomorrow and then upper 70s and low 80s from Wednesday straight through Sunday. All in all, though, dry conditions aside from that slight chance of a shower out there for your Tuesday. St. Patty's Day not looking too bad either, aside from some extra clouds. As mentioned, though, down by the beaches, there will be that cool breeze developing off the ocean to make it feel a little bit chillier. So just be aware of that if you're planning on maybe enjoying some of this spring like warmth down by the beaches. It is going to be noticeably cooler down at the beach. Otherwise, have yourself a great Monday and get this week off to a fantastic start. Remember, you can always get the latest news and weather updates on your website, carolinalive.com.